What's great about everyday math is that it's constantly reinforcing skills as well as providing manipulatives and other ways to teach lessons. Where in the old mathematics you were taught to multiply one way or you're taught to divide one way and if you didn't get it, it's kind of tough luck. Now with the different algorithms and strategies, what I do is I teach all of them to the students and they master all of them and then when it comes time I let them pick the one that's best for them. It gives the kids the opportunity to review things through math boxes, through minute math, through the math messages and through mental math. So it's not just opening a book and repeating the same 50 problems over and over and over again. These problems build from the basic foundations until the children feel confident to tackle any problem, word in any way, whether it be in your strict number sentence form or in your word problem form, whether it's an outside the box thinking question, whether it's an open-ended question. It's a great program that really introduces kids to concepts at a variety of levels. And it's just a lot more learning for the kids than any of the programs I've used. We need to utilize differentiated instruction to reach the different levels in our class and the everyday math allows us with the different algorithms and methods to reach our higher students and challenge them and also to bring our lower students up to where they need to be. The kids are involved in the math. I don't see the teacher standing at the front of the room lecturing them and then them doing pages and pages of worksheet problems. They're involved. They're functioning at higher levels. I'm seeing an increase in student engagement. I see kids touching math, kids talking about math, kids looking at math, and they're just totally immersed in the process. And that's the way math should be taught.